Hey, what's going on, guys? Let's try this problem right here. This question is asking find the unit tangent vector to the space curve described by this function. And let's see how we can do this. So, first of all, what we have to do is we have to find the tangent vector and divide by its magnitude. That's going to give us the unit tangent vector. Now, to find the tangent vector, what we do is we find the derivative of this one. So, if you find the derivative of this one, so this is our tangent vector. Tangent vector is going to be derivative of this function and if you find the derivative of this function this is going to give us negative 3t square plus 1 in the i direction and plus long t square first of all this is going to be a chain rule right so first uh, we have to multiply the two front so 2 long t and derivative of long t is going to be 1 over t so this is going to be 2 times 1 over t in the j direction and then cos phi t derivative of cos is sine negative sine actually negative sine phi t and uh, here we have to use the chain rule again that's going to be multiplied by phi again so we have to put a minus here this is going to become minus minus sine phi t times phi in the k direction we can put the phi in front so instead of writing like this we can put phi sine phi t in the k direction <coughs> now what we have to do is we had to plug it in the value so we know that at the question is asking at the point t is equal to 1 now r prime of 1 is going to be just negative 3 times 1 square that's going to be just negative 3 plus 1 in the i direction and plus 2 times 1 over 1 that's going to be just 2 in the j direction negative phi and sine phi t so sine phi times t is 1 so sine phi is 0 right so 0 times phi that's going to be 0 so this is going to be just 0 k and uh, if it's zero k okay, the plus or minus it doesn't matter right so what we can do is plus minus and this is going to be we can put plus also so this is plus zero k okay. and uh, now let's simplify this one so this is going to be negative two in the i direction and plus 2 in the j direction plus 0 in the k direction finally we can write minus 2 2 0 now we have found out the tangent vector then to find the unit vector we have to find the magnitude of this one to find the magnitude we just square root and square all of them so the magnitude of this is going to be square root of <coughs> this one times square plus 2 square plus 0 square that's going to be just 0 and uh, this is going to be 4 plus 4 8 square root of 8 and that's going to give us 4 times 2 that's going to be 2 root 2 right so we have the magnitude and the equation for the unit tangent vector is this unit tangent vector is equal to vector tangent vector over the magnitude of the vector and let's do that one right here and we know that tangent vector is negative 2 2 0 divided by 2 root 2 and if you divide that one that's going to give you negative 1 over root 2 and here we are going to have 1 over root 2 and then 0 over root 2 that's going to be still 0 and that's it this is going to be our final answer i hope you guys find this video helpful see you next time actually this one is divide right divide we find the derivative of this one given function and then plus the t value whatever the t value they have, they have given and then we find the magnitude of that one and uh, then divide like vector over the magnitude and that's going to give us the unit tangent vector 
and that's how we do this kind of problems. I hope you guys find this video helpful. See you next time.